Alright everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. What's up? My name is Victoria Rose, and today I am bringing you along with me to a shoot. It's currently 7.15 a.m. I've already showered, made my coffee, and it's time for me to beat my face. I have to leave here around 8.30. Uh, maybe like 8.45 ish because you know girls always late. Uh, so basically I am going to do a photo shoot for my friend's startup magazine. This magazine is called Hefner. It's like a mixture of gay times and Playboy but like less revealing than Playboy. At least my shoot is going to be less revealing than Playboy. So today I'm going for three looks. We're sort of focusing on a Jennifer's body theme so I'm going to try and do a Megan Fox inspired makeup look. After these three photos, he's going to edit them, send them back to me in a couple days. I'll review them and approve them. And then when they're approved, I'm actually going back because I am their honorary angel. So I will be the centerfold of their magazine and they're going to do an interview, a podcast, or just a magazine interview. I don't know, but I'm so excited. So yeah, either way, no matter what comes of this, I'm excited for the photos. And Justin is a great friend of mine, so I'm excited to see him to get some great photos. And I don't know, I believe I believe in his vision, so I'm excited to see where this magazine goes. So I'm gonna do my makeup and I will bring you guys along with me. Just a heads up, like I said, it is a startup magazine, so the, the, the shoot is going to take place really like in a room, like not like a whole set. I'm not bringing you on to this, to MGM models. Before I dive into makeup, I have a word from our wonderful sponsor over at Catch Beauty. Hi there, if you know me, if you've been following me for a while, then you would know that body hair removal and permanent body hair removal has been been a huge roadblock in my transition. For years, I had to shave my arms and my legs every single day if I wanted a smooth result, and I had already spent thousands of dollars hand over fist at salon and electrolysis lasers on my face and my bikini, so I was just not interested in spending that money on my whole body. So I did some research, and that is when I found Cash Beauty's at-home IPL laser hair removal device. This laser is my top recommended method of permanent hair removal and permanent hair reduction. I, like I said, used to have to shave my arms like every single day and you can see here I have no hairs the ones that I do are like blonde hairs that wouldn't be picked up anyway with our IPL handset you can get salon quality results at home for a fraction of the price also it's in the comfort of your own home and you can use it anywhere on your entire body instead of booking a section for your calf and then your thigh and then your tummy and then your chest Girl, you would be in a salon for years. On top of their incredible products, I really love what Catch Beauty stands for. They have been supporting the trans community since day one, providing us with resources. Catch Beauty wants to help us through even the hairiest parts of our transition. So whether you are trans, not trans, man, woman, somewhere in between, if you want permanent hair removal and permanent hair reduction, I highly recommend you click the link in my description box down below. Check out the Catch Beauty at home IPL laser hair removal device and you Use code ROSE to get money off your order. Thank you so much to Catch Beauty for sponsoring this portion of today's video. And without further ado, babe, let's paint our face and get ready to go to a shoot. All right, you guessed it, I am running late. Ah, but this is the final look. Oh my God, can we focus, please? Hello, okay. This is the final look. Um, I am wearing this sort of like ballet top, not even ballet, but it was called a ballet top on Amazon. Um, let me give you the full look. Don't mind the mess, whatever, but this is the fit. I'm gonna throw on my filas and um, I will see you when I'm there. Okay, I'm literally an idiot and I left my camera at home. So I'm going to vlog with my iPhone 14 Max Pro, whatever. I got myself in there, so I'm gonna bring it in and I'll see you inside.
All right, y'all, we are out here for the second part of the shoot. Justin took me out here to murder me. Um, we're in the vanilla of the woods. Justin, are you here to murder me? Um, I guess I'll find out. I don't know if you can guess what kind of shoot this might be, but I'm going to have some fake blood on me and this puffer jacket, as well as, actually, I don't even know that I can show you because it's too short, but this little denim skirt. So I wonder who it could be. Okay, bitches, and it is a wrap for today. I am a million degrees. Look a little like Spider-Man from here up, but trust me, it's kind. This is not, that's not just wait until I get home. Okay, I'll see you guys later, bye. All right, I am back. Sorry, I look a little bit of a mess. Um, it was so unbelievably hot outside. It's really not, I mean, let me see, hold up. Oh, no, 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 okay, it's 78 degrees outside right now. It is 78 mother degrees. And while some of the looks were a little like risque or I was in like a little shorts and like a bra or whatever, I was also in a puffer jacket. I was also in like long dresses and I was also in heels walking in like dirt. Okay, let me, let me start from the beginning. I had a great time. First of all, I had a great time. I had a great time. I wasn't sure how much I could tell you about the magazine before because it hasn't launched yet. This is a new magazine startup called Hefner, run by my friend Justin. Basically, they are all about, actually, let me read you their mission statement. Hold on. At Hefner, we celebrate women in the LGBTQ plus community every day, showcasing the people who live their lives unapologetically against social constructs and standards. Hefner is a way for us to uplift the community and celebrate all things you. We believe in strong family values and a fight for change in this climate where we need it most. With so many voices being silenced, we want to be the force against it and open another platform for people to feel safe again. It's like a mixture of like gay times and like Playboy or like whatever. So they're featuring all different models, all different girlies for their centerfolds and stuff. Basically, I had a few different, you'll see I'm sure in the vlogs, but I had a few different looks and I did some indoor shoots and some outdoor shoots, but the outdoor ones were mainly focused on Jennifer's body. You guys know how much I love Jennifer's body and Megan Fox in general, so I'm so happy I got to, I've always wanted to do a Jennifer's body cosplay, so I'm so happy you got to do it. Um, the ones in the woods, bitch, I saw some of the raw photos. They are so beautiful. Like, Justin is so talented. Not to my own horn, but I'm so fucking gorgeous. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but I, I I feel so pretty from them. Like, I just can't wait to see the final product. And then once I do see the final product, I will select my favorites. He will select his favorites. We'll chit chat. And then I'm going to meet up with him again to do the, like, cheerleader Jennifer's body costume and uh, do the centerfold, the angel centerfold. So I'm sure you guys will see that soon. Uh, I think it should really be out uh, in like four weeks, like totally, but I think the photos will be posted in the next like two. And while I'm there, they're also going to be doing, I don't know if it's going to be like a podcast or just the written interview, but I think it's a podcast of just interview questions of some fun and some serious questions about my journey, how I've overcome things, and also like me and my interests. And uh, you know, like it's a mixture of a Gay Times interview and also like the, the centerfold what am I thinking of? The deets, like the, what's your measurements? You know what I'm saying? The pictorials, like a mixture of like a Gay Times interview and a pictorial in Playboy. Um, I, I think that's such a great idea. So I can't wait to see the finished product and I'm sure y'all will see it very soon. It really did not take that long, especially considering we went to a second location. So I'm already home and it's like 1 p.m. And I'm going to wash my hair because bitch, it was so hot and my long hair was like getting all over the fake blood. It looks like I have a sunburn. It's just fake blood rubbed in. Uh, and it just got like sticky and it, it melted into one like hard thing. So babe, I gotta wash my hair. I gotta wash my face. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Do make sure you please give it a thumbs up. It helps out my channel so much. You are all amazing. Thank you so much for joining me. And until I see you next week, good luck. I love you.